G'day guys, it's Ben uh, from Oscar Zebos and Hutch. You may remember me from the front page. Quick little tour about one of our barley huts and just to point out some really vital things about our huts. Um, what you'll notice here on this particular hut, 150 by 150 square post. These ones are cypress. They were opted for the rough sawn. You can have them dressed if you like. We can upgrade the hardwood, merbau or aquila. Um, you'll notice big corner braces on this one because this is a massive hut. Okay. The beams are bolted, not screwed, okay? Important things there. I'm just rushing through so the video's not too long for you guys. Really important factor of our huts, and probably one of the most important, is up here. You'll see how the, be the, the rafter comes down and sits on top of the beam. A lot of competitors run their rafter on the inside, okay? And then rely on screws. You'll also see that you get a kicker, okay? This is called a kicker beam, or kicker, a kicker plate. Right, this holds your thatch nice and straight. If you can just shoot down there for me, you'll see that it's nice and straight all the way and gives you a bigger overhang. That helps with longevity. But we'll just pop inside, right, very quickly. We're going to look up. Look at that tight thatch spacing. That's 55 millimetres, okay? And here's the most important thing to know about this hut. It's almost 10 years old. It's like the day it was put in. It's 100% waterproof never leaks the insulation underneath is magnificent okay so remember pre-cut pre-stained aussie made fully engineered tight that spacing longevity thanks for visiting